Hey guys, Mario vs. Peach here, welcoming you back to Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy. In the last episode, we got up to Snowy Mountain and did a fair bit. So I think in this episode, we're going to continue on. And hopefully, we should be able to finish it this episode. Because there's not much left to do, so yeah. Oh jeez. Come on, I don't want to start off the episode by falling, or dying, or whatever. Ow. Can I get this precursor blocker? Please. Please. Thank you. Aha. And that was our, our last one. So, we're going to get that. That's our first one for this episode. Fantastic. If you don't know where they are, I did cover most of them in my last in the last episode. So, make sure you check that out. Right, these enemies are killing themselves. So. Oh, I don't actually want to go this way first. I need to think, I need to think first where I need to be and where I need to go. So, I think that's the best plan of strategy action-ish. Okay, how about we start by going up this way? Kill you. Don't actually think there's much point. I think this is just leading us back around to, oh geez, a different part of the area. But that's okay because I don't care. Alright. Now I do know there is some other things that we need to do that I haven't exactly done yet. Like going up to here. There is actually a part under here that I need to get to, as you can see. So there's a power cell there, but I don't remember how to do that. Um, I head down. Going down seems like the bet. <sighs> Alright, so I've taken kind of a different path, because... Trying to just remember where I need to be, that's all. Um, is anything over here going to be of importance to me? How about we check? Ow, go away. Stupid things. Right, jump across here. We were here last episode, but I don't think I want to go this way, actually. In all honesty, I don't really want to die. Ah! Alright, I think we might have covered everything in this part, to be honest. Well, in this area of the level. So I might actually head back up and start again just by reworking around. It takes a while, especially if you haven't played this game as much. Like I have, like, like I said, I've only completed it through once. And when you, do, when you haven't played it in a while as well, that kind of affects your mentality on the whole situation. So yeah. Right, so I'm going to head up this way first, and we're going to jump along. Ow. Getting hurt there, left, right, and center, so... What's it? Ah! Let's go this way. Thought there was an area we were missing. Oh! This should lead us to where we need to be next. Oh, narrow pathway is narrow. Ugh! Very nerve-wracking. And there's our last scout fly too, so... Excellent! Fantastic, so we made some progress. Excellent. That's what I like to see. Oh boy! Oh. I actually think we need to come back this way anyways. There is some things that look like need to be blah 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 blah. There looks like there needs to be some things that have to be opened first. I need to remember how to get down here. Maybe I can spot it. Maybe I can spot it. So there's an underground path that leads there. Hmm. I must have skipped something over. I have this feeling I skipped something over, which I'm probably getting yelled at for. Um. Where are we? What am I doing? Alright, what have we done? So I need to stop the Lurker Glacier troops. There's one more that I haven't even done. And, yeah, how are we going for... 188 out of 200 is pretty good. Um... Alright, just to save time, just to save you guys having to look with me, I'll cut to when I find out what I need to do next. Okay, guys, I'm pretty sure I found out where I need to be next, or at least one of the places I need to be next, is 
is this guy here, so yeah, kill him. Now go away. Um, I need to actually find some red eco, to be honest, before I go and tackle that guy. Hit first. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. No. Thank you. Come at me, bro. Let's see how far you get. There. And there we go. That was for defeating all the lurker troopers. Excellent. Whew. Good. Fantastic. Alright, so we're going to head back up now. I still haven't found out where we need to go to get that uh, bottom pit, but... Yeah. I'll cut again. Okay, I found where to go. You see these trees here? You can walk right through them this whole time. And I completely forgot about that, to be honest. It is kind of easy to miss. Especially when you haven't played this. Oh, jeez. It's a good thing we didn't get kicked back so far, so it's all good. Alright, so this should unlock those that yellow eco vent that we so desperately need. Okay. Oh, I'm not gonna make it again. Alright, third time's the charm, they always say. So Yes, good. Third time is the charm. And jump up quickly. Oh boy. Oh no, I'm not liking these ice physics. Alright, I'll wait for that thing to go back in. Out again, and then jump. Good. Oh boy. Oh man. I'm taking it. I'm going very, very risky here. But that's okay. Because now we have found the yellow eco vent, which was underneath that ice pond. Fantastic. And there we go. <sighs> so which way do I have to head now? That's my thing. Uh, I think I have to go right back through that whole path again. Let's cut. Turns out we don't because I just slid down. And that has taken us right back out here. Oh boy. Alright, so there was a couple of paths that we needed to take in order to find some yellow eco. Uh, and that would unlock some crates and chests and blah 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 for us. So we're going to go do that now. And also, we have one more. Ah, open the frozen crate. So where's that? We need to find that now that we have our... Yellow Eco. So we're going to head back this way to the start of the level. And I'm going to take that path that I normally take to get to around near the middle area. And then we're going to go and um, break open those crates we saw. Hopefully that'll have the power cell in it as well. But I don't know. So we're going to jump across here. It might actually be along this path, to be honest. So we're going to do it. We're going to go like this. There we are! Haha! <laughs> we did it! We found it! So it was good that we came back this way. Alright, and we're gonna quickly head across. Uh, we've used this before anyway, so it's nothing new to us. It's the fireballs. Is that not all the precursor orbs? There we go! And that snowy mountain, 100% complete! Thanks to all those cuts, it's not taken us that long. So, we're going to head back down to the Volcanic Crater now. <coughs> Sorry, I had to sneeze there, that's why I kind of died. Um, yeah, so we're going to head back down to the Volcanic Crater. And then we're going to head to the next level, and our last level before we head to the final area. So, uh, okay, there we go. Now it's just a matter of us crossing this path again, and we're done. 
So yeah, Snowy Mountain didn't take us that long, to be honest, which is pretty good. Ow. Can we get down before we die, please? Thank you. And all those enemies were about to attack us, so that's good. Alright, we also need to go back to that area to get to the Volcanic Crater. Remember how we had that power cell we couldn't get? Well, now we can go and get it. It's a very monotonous kind of one, but we're going to go get it before we head uh, to the next area. Yep. Okay. So I want to take that path again. Don't need to go see the miners anymore. They're finished and done with for us. So we can head around. And that'll take us back to the path that we need to be. So yeah, we're making fantastic progress. I love it. We shouldn't, to be honest, we shouldn't actually be that long till we're finished. This game isn't very long. It's just taken me a long time to upload parts, that's all. Alright, so we're going to head back to that grassy, hilly area. Thank goodness this shouldn't take us too long. And we also have some uh, power cells that we are missing along, I mean, precursor orbs that we are missing along this path too. So whether or not they are in the place that I'm thinking of, or I have just completely missed them, is an entirely different scenario. As you can see, that's our power cell up there. I don't want to hit those TNTs. Oh, not TNTs, dynamite things. Ah, oh, here they are. So we found those. So that's all the precursor orbs here. Now we just need to go grab that power cell. Cool. So I don't need to sit there for five years trying to unlock something. We want to hit this rock here. And we want to jump. And that's our power cell for this area. That's this area complete now. Now we can just blast our way through. So I'll meet you guys back. Alright. Now that we're back. Cool. Alrighty, so now that we're back, we're going to head to the next level, but first we're going to explore this hub world a bit, just because we haven't actually unlocked a lot of the things that need to be done. So yeah, that shouldn't take us too long, to be honest. Um, so I guess the first plan of action is to actually get over to the things that we need to be at. By doing that, we can just simply jump up here. And that, we can hear scout flies as well. So, yeah. Alright, jump down here. Cool, so that's our third one. And we have a precursor of Oracle. Seek the pure light, for within its flame, the answers reside. You can gain my power cells by bringing 120 precursor orbs for each. You have obtained another power cell. Cool. I don't know, do we have enough to afford the next one? Hopefully we do, because then I don't have to come back. No, we don't. We've got 14 more we're missing. They should be in the overworld here, to be honest. But, uh, I guess it can wait. It can wait. It's not that out of the way, so yeah. Alright, so now that we've found that power cell, and that scout fall, not found that power cell, or rather gotten that power cell. Um, what's over here? That's the miners. Don't need to visit them again. Um, I think we can actually head over this way, past the snowy mountain entrance. And there's a scout fly. Oh. Alright, we have more than enough power cells, but I don't want to go there just yet, because that is the final area, that is where our final boss will be, but it's no good going to a final boss if you don't have everything in the game, right? <clears throat> it's kind of why, that's why I don't, like with Mario Galaxy, I don't really like the fact that you can't actually, um, have all the power uh, the power stars 
before you complete the final boss. Like you gotta do the final boss, then that unlocks the, the comet, and then you can do the uh, get the rest of the stars, and then you can get 100%. I just I don't find that all too good. So we're just gonna ride these around now, collecting off the rest of the things before we head into our next area, because I think it's good. Honestly, I think if we end the episode by collecting most of the things that we can in here, that'll be pretty good. We're not going to the lava tube yet. So, don't expect it anytime soon. It probably won't be for a couple more episodes. Okay, so how many is that now? That is 46 out of 50. So you do get achievements as well in this game. I might show them off later. Once we have finished this LP. Because I have gotten all the achievements. It's not that hard to get all the achievements, honestly. As long as you play the game right through and get everything, you'll be fine. It's not actually that... Honestly, I don't know why you wouldn't want to finish this game. Hun. Okay, like I was saying, I don't know why you wouldn't want to complete this game 100% the first time through, to be honest. It's not that hard to do. Just as long as you search everywhere, you, you pretty much get everything. Most of the stuff you need to do anyways. Alright, any more power cell? Ah, oh, we have our scout fly over here. Excellent! So that's all the scout flies. Great way to end the episode, I reckon. But we're going to grab these, and that'll be the rest of the pa uh, Precursor Orbs. So, I think we're going to leave things off here for today. And in the next episode of Jack and Daxter, we're going to head into the Spider Cave. This looks very, very foreboding. <laughs>